when I get out here, man, I'm in, whew, I'm in heaven. <laughs> I love it out here. I can't imagine going through my life without experiencing, you know, the sun coming up, being on the water. I'm between being an idiot and a genius. But hey, I know what I want to do. And hey, shrimping I want to do. I can live a long time in here. This fresh air and open marsh. Like that. And it's like a paradise down here, man. Right? And nobody can complain when you're living in paradise. You could walk the land, you can't walk it no more. They didn't have these canals here. Yeah. I could drive this boat places where you used to you couldn't you couldn't go with a boat. The land that's gone. They could say what they want, they're going to do what they want, they'll never bring it back. It's too far gone. We're the fastest disappearing landmass on Earth. A hundred years ago, two hundred years ago, nothing eliminated the city of New Orleans. There was a lot of protective turf out there. Katrina is going to be, I think, a small scale scenario of what we're going to see in the future. The train wreck is right in front of us. We're all told this could never happen. And it happened big time. It's all the way up to the Chandler Islands. We've been having trouble with the oil companies for over 50 years. They just gave them a wide open ticket to do what they wanted. Louisiana's been hijacked by Big Oil. Their whole mission has been to convince the people of Louisiana that they did not cause coastal erosion. And it worked. The state is not going to say no to oil and gas. They vote in lockstep with the oil industry, period. That's what the money is. You follow the money. You open your mouth, we're going to change the law. You don't think we can do it? We'll hire 50 lobbyists and bombard that capital, and we'll change the law. The worry isn't about the oil, it's what the oil leaves behind. This is an issue of do two wrongs make a right. My mama raised me said, no, they do not. Why just pick on the oil companies? Go get everybody. The idea that you pay someone that you've harmed is as old as human nature. If we lose all the wetlands, the state will be getting all the oil and gas. So the state has no incentive to save the wetlands. It's still the oil field that started this. And then it's the oil field that's going to finish this, because this is going to be over. We sold our soul to the devil. Sold our souls to the devil.